Take a listen to this next story. Now, for some artists, it takes trying out different mediums to figure out what suits them best. And others know almost instantly. Now, the last statement rings true for Sikos Pelele Nkuku, an up-and-coming ceramicist in Cape Town who is hoping to inspire the youth with his business. As an artist, I chose clay because it kind of mixes everything in one. So I get to draw, I get to paint on clay, and it actually gives me a sense of a being. Hi everyone, my name is Sikom Koko, and I'm the owner of Siko Ceramic. So the inspiration of my patterns come from Ichali. That is a, a blanket commonly known in the Eastern Cape that our parents, our mothers throw. For, for different reasons really, but I grab the one that's more significant to everyone, which is the warmth, it represents the warmth. But in this sense, it represents the warmth of home. I try and translate that into my artifacts, the surface. My product range consists of mostly the functional items, which is the tableware items, your coffee mugs, your bowls, tea sets, vases. I would say it's like 80% of the tableware range and the deco items, 20% of them. So when I get into a zone, it's like getting into a flow state where bringing back the memories, you know, positive memories, positive thoughts and solutions are then being developed in that state. And I get to have new ideas. I mean, while I'm working on the specific product and flowing on it, my mind, it's very broad. The inspiration in terms of my colors on my patterns, I take that mostly from the flowers. You know, a flower doesn't really get one um, color. It, 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 it has multiple colors, but I personally choose like three of them to complete each pattern that I, that I make. So about life, clay has taught me to be more patient and to be willing to adapt. So situations don't always go as you plan. You might take work and put in the kiln, like have a, a, a kiln full of work and then only to find that when you open, things have cracked. So as we go along with this journey, we get to learn, we get to face those challenges. And Man, we get to be sad, we get to be happy, we get all the emotions that you can ever think of. But most of all, we, we embrace all these emotions. I do see myself working with clay for the rest of my life, but it doesn't mean that I won't be challenged by other materials. So I will keep exploring whenever life gives me an opportunity. In future, I hope my brand represents hope, represents uh, courage, and represents longevity. I want young people, when they look at it, they, they, they see future, and then they can relate into my brand. They can relate into myself, whether they are facing um, not so pleasant experiences, just for them to, to know that they, they can find something to validate their lives and actually go on forward in life. Ah, oh, man. Eko, Eko is my man. Listen, it's so, so inspiring to see that. Um, and may you continue to pour your love and your passion into what you do. And in so doing, shape the lives of your community around you and continue to inspire South Africa. We are privileged to be part of your journey. That's Eko. Thank you very much, man.